Hello friends, we'll start with question number 22. Basically, we need to find the inequality on this expression that is s equal to 1 by root r sigma r equal to 1 to n. Here n I am taking as 51599. Now, let's take a general term 1 by root r that is tr. So I'll multiply 2 in the numerator and denominator. Now this can again can be written as denominator I am writing root r plus root r. Now its upper limit I can write if I replace 1 root r by the smaller quantity like r minus 1. Upon rationalization it will become 2 times root r minus r minus 1. Now it gives a telescopic sum. Now if I keep on adding this term leaving 1 so which means now what I am doing t1 plus t2 plus dot dot tn that is s basically. Now t1 is 1 so I am not putting 1 over here that is trivial I am putting 2 to n over here and adding them. So it will become like root 2 minus root 1 if I am putting 3 that it will become root 3 minus root 2 it is keep on cancelling alternatively. So what will I get? 1 plus 2 times last term it will be root under 1599 minus 1. So it on the upon simplification it will get root under 1599 minus 1. Now that will be less than if I 1599 if I am replacing with 1600 it will be greater than that one. So it means 1600 square root we know it is 40. So 40 into 2 80 minus 1 that is 79. So s is less than 79 that we get the upper limit. Now we will find lower limit. So again we will take the same general term. So which means I am taking over here tr equal to 1 by root r. Again I will write in the same way like root r plus root r. Now it will be greater if I replace 1 root r by greater term that is root under r plus 1. Upon rationalization it will yield 2 into root under r plus 1 minus root r. Again if I put now I will write s as t1 to dot dot tn. Now it will cancel alternatively like if you put 1 over here so it will be 2 times root 2 minus root 1 plus 2 times if you put 2 over there it will give root 3 minus root 2 it is keep on cancelling. So what will I get? So s will be greater than now. s is greater than now. 2 times now here it will be root under n plus 1 minus root 1 now n is 51599 so basically it will be 1600 over root that is 40 40 minus 1 that is 39 into 2 it is 78 so we get both lower and upper limit like we find s is greater than 78 and s is less than 79 so which means its greatest integer must be 78 that is the question greatest integer of s that we need to find that is 78 so that is our answer.